Hello everybody, Shadow here, and welcome back to Pokemon Violet! Last time, we arrived... That's not the button I wanted to press, I wanted to press this one. We arrived out here, right by the Dark Crew base of Team Star. They are blocking the road to... Cascaratha? Sure. Um, so, we have to kick their butts! To get through. So let's do it. Whoa, whoa, hold it, you. Up ahead's the base of operations for Team Star's Dark Crew. You may know us as the, uh, you may know us as the Sagan, Sagan Squad? I don't know. Yep, and we don't take too kindly to random kids sniffing around our turf. Sorry, but if you don't turn yourself around here, amigo, we'll have to send you packing. Wait, hold up. Just going on a hunch here, but are you that shadow kid? You know, that piece of work we're out to get for declaring war on Team Star? Maybe I am. Maybe I am, he says, cool as a cucumber. Honesty is not always the best policy, you know. Ugh, you know what? Doesn't matter who you are. You're not getting through. Buzz off or get thrashed by me and Battle Kid. What'll it be? I'll take you on. Ah, sassy kids like you are the worst. That's it. Prepare to get stomped into the dirt. Okay. Good luck to you, but... I'm not that scared. Murkrow. All right. Squishy! One Pokemon. Oh my. I didn't even see, what? They're level 19 and they did that much damage? Oh my. Squishy, no! I failed you, Squishy. Once again. Um. Let's see. I think we just go for Chomper. Just. That. No. No, thank you. <laughs> I don't know how that happened. Someone seems to have made popcorn. I don't know if it's Dylan, my brother, or if it's another apartment. But I smell popcorn. Maybe I'm just going crazy. Uh, the user yells as if it's ranting about something, which lowers the special attack stats of opposing Pokemon. Okay. Honestly, let's just get rid of Tackle. I think Round is a better option than tackle anyway, just in general. Okay, Yusus wants to learn Psybeam. That seems like a pretty good option. Okay, power 65, accuracy 100, chance to confuse the target. Um, that really just sounds like a better confusion. So I'm going to do that. <laughs> Yeah! Why did such a sassy kid have to be so strong? <laughs> uh, how the heck could I lose? Well, whatever. It's your problem now. Finish up here for me, would you, bud? Okay, thanks. Hasta la vista! Uh, hasta la vista... Okay. Uh, she's new to the team, you know? Might have to have a little chat with her about that attitude. Ugh. Well, I'm gonna go into the base now and give the rest of the squad the heads up. It will come at you full force if you set foot inside, so you might want to consider turning tail. Either way, best of luck to you, amigo. Hasta la vista! 
Right. Sure. Rotototo. I see you took care of the guards. Nice work. Yup. Now, hold up and hold up in that base is Team Star's dark crew. The Sagin Squad. I I don't know how it Sagin? Sagin? I don't know. Their boss, uh Giacomo? Uh Giacomo pretty much runs the whole of Team Star, and he also produced that wild soundtrack of theirs himself. He's a sharp guy. Even our declaration of war won't have ruffled him in the slightest. His plan is probably to wear you down with a wave of grunts, then finish you off himself. No use trying to outthink strategic, sty strategic types like him. Bring him down with a head-on attack. Just keep on defeating as many Pokemon as you can until the big man himself shows up. Ring the bell on the gates once you're ready to kick off this phase of the operation. Time to wipe the Sigin squad off the map. Right, right. Okay. Um, hold on. What's my team health looking like right now? Okay. Squishy's dead. Okay, let's put Chomper in the lead. Let's just go for it. Oh, first three Pokemon in my party. Um, hold on. In that case, we probably should heal our team and think about this more. So I, I will think about it as I go back to the Pokemon Center. All right. We are ready. Da -da -da -dun -dun -dun. Careful now, Shadow. The team Star has a unique way of doing battle. They call it a Star Barrage. To get through it, you'll need to use the R button to send out multi multiple Pokemon and have them battle at the same time. If your Pokemon get low on health, come back here and I'll heal them up for you. The grunts you'll be facing will heal up their Pokemon too, so stay sharp out there. Okay, okay. Beep. Heads up, gang! Some jumped up kid has wandered in thinking he can raid our base. Clearly he doesn't know who he's messing with. Let's teach him a lesson he won't forget. To our unwanted guests, if you can defeat 30 of our Pokemon in the next 10 minutes, our boss might just honor you with an appearance. Okay. Send out your Pokemon with the R button to try to defeat a set number of Team Star's Pokemon before time runs out. When you're taking on the challenge of a Star Barrage, you can have three Pokemon out at the same time. You lose in a Star Barrage if all your Pokemon get too worn out or uh, to battle or time runs out. If one of your Pokemon can no longer battle, you can use you can help it recover HP by using a vending machine. Okay. Go, Muffin! Go, Usus! Yeah! Four! Dead right already. Very good, everybody. Oof. Muffin took quite a hit. Let's head back to Clive. Yes, please. All right. Where do we got more? Okay, we got a couple over here. Get him. Oh, okay. Where do we got more? We got some Murkrows over here. Perfect. 18 of 30. Right. Twenty one. Twenty five. Okay. All right. 
We should be good, because there's two over here. Come on. There we go. That was kind of sad. <laughs> He's way above our level. We've got to go get the boss. <laughs> Great. Oh my. Hello, hello. Howdy. You've done a real number on us, party crasher. Shadow, was it? I am, I'm Giacomo. At the deck, I go by DJ Vice. Call me whichever, it's a vibe either way. Nice to meet you and all, but how about we skip straight on, straight to your outro. Don't worry, I'll play you a sick requiem as you crash and burn. Let's get this party started! All right. Let's do it. Okay. Muffin! You don't really think things through, do ya? Declaring war on Team Star is a real bad move. Yeah, all right, let's go ahead and play rough. This beat will, uh, this beat drop will bust your ears open. DJ Vice, bring down the house. Oh my. Ha, <laughs> how's that for an opening track? I'll spin you up good, party crasher. All right, well, I wasn't expecting Muffin to be very effective. I was kind of hoping I could get a debuff. All right, let's go ahead and swap out. Let's see. Would Psybeam or... Is Psychic or Fairy more effective? I, I, I think it's... I think it's fairy type. Um, let's go disarming voice. Hey, you just avoided the avoided the attack. Wonderful. Let's try side beam. I guess it's not saying it's super effective. Probably because this is not specifically a dark type. Okay, never mind. Psychic doesn't affect it. Never mind. I'm stupid. <laughs> This is why I just used Chomper. <laughs> because I'm dumb. <laughs> oh, why did I use Bite? That was foolish. And a misprep. Burn an eight! Ha ha! Rever room. Time to up the tempo. This show ain't over yet. Oh, the whole thing's a Pokemon. Fascinating. Well, let's pump up the party! Let's do it! Wicked Torque? Oh no. Alright, alright. Not bad, not bad. Not great. Sleep! Really?
Great. Um, okay, hold on. Anyone have... Okay, so Fairy is super effective. So it would be nice if we could get Muffin or... Usus back in the mix. Let's go ahead and revive Muffin. But we won't switch to them immediately. Snarl, okay. It's kind of silly to see <laughs> um, the the Starmobile Reverum. Like, <laughs> you see them move, and the the character disappears. <laughs> the the trainer. <laughs> All right, let's just go ahead and use Dragon Breath. Metal Sound. Okay. Special Defense? Nah, I should be fine. Um, let's just use this again. Ugh, that's not great. And sleep! Wonderful. You know, I am technically, I, th I think, technically speaking, it would have probably been a better idea to go east. I mean, it is still level 20, so it should be fine. Okay, we're gonna throw out Azure, and we're gonna try to get some people revived. All right. Ooh. Okay. I would like to revive you. And then if if Azure somehow survives. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. We're going to go ahead and So we're going to use a super potion and heal Chomper. All right. But then I think, let's go ahead and throw out Wu. Okay. And then, We'll heal up Muffin. There's Wicked Torque again. We do survive. But Wu is probably not fast enough to survive. Oh, do we want... Hmm. Okay, you know, I feel like we should get Muffin to... Full, full health. I probably should have just used a super potion the first time. The first time. Okay. I'm going to try to use Muffin. Because if we can get... Play Rough should, or hopefully can debuff attack, which would help a lot. Ooh. Just in general did a decent amount of damage, which is fair because it's super effective, but okay. I don't know if it'll survive, if, if Muffin will survive. Nope. Okay. But I think I think, I think Chomper at full health should be able to take it down. I hope so. Okay. Okay, if we get one more hit in, we should be good. 
All right. It, it was a little close. But it's fine. What's probably not fine is the fact that Chomper gets all the XP from this. <laughs> Guess that's that. <laughs> About a year and a half ago. Oh. Guess that's that. What's up, uh, Giacomo? Did something happen? I don't know who's talking. The big boss just wanted my take on some stuff. So we had a chat and settled on a few plans. A few plans? Like for what? Operation Star, first of all. And also, a new code of conduct for the team. You know how tons of new members have joined up recently? Well, we figure we gotta make some team rules. Like a code. So we'll all be on the same page. Uh, nice. Uh, you've, you'll come up with a great code for us, won't you, Giacomo? I don't know anything about these characters. So I'm like, I'm just gonna do something and we'll probably change it later. Heh, <laughs> no thanks. Way too much pressure. I mean, yeah, I used to be the president of the student council, but you know everyone ended up hating me after that, right? Of course we know. You forced a ton of stuffy rules on everyone, and they wouldn't take it. We've got some other nerd to replace you after, like, five minutes. I can't help but concur. Male students' hair must stray no further than 1.8 inches below the nape, and so forth. Your rules were vexation made manifest. My point exactly. Uh, so you'll all agree that I shouldn't be, be let be let anywhere near this new code. Uh, but you always know what's best for the team, Giacomo. You look out for us. Uh, you've earned our trust many times over. Without you, Team Star just wouldn't work. That stuck-up student council prez isn't who you are anymore, man. A code written by the Giacomo I'm looking at now. I'd follow that any day. As would I. Okay, okay. Thanks for the ego boost, everyone. I'll do it. I'll write up the darn code. Okay. I did the best I could. I wrote that code myself, and there's no going back on it now. <sighs> my days as a boss are over. So here, take my star badge, would ya? Sure. Hooray! <laughs> Photo up! <laughs> Great. <laughs> I'll give you this choice TM too. You're into fair and square. Hooray! Nice. <laughs> so this is how the party ends. But let's talk about those Pokemon of yours. They're crazy strong, huh? Uh, you learn those trainer chops at the academy? Like, what moves you should use and stuff. It's all instinct, baby! Some not for the best. <laughs> nope. Huh. Okay. You like it at the academy? Having fun? Yeah, I'm enjoying it. No kidding. Sorry to interrupt, but are you Giacomo? Whoa! I wasn't expecting a giant pompadour to make a guest appearance today. Says the one, says the guy with wings for hair. You get a Quaxel to, uh, Quaxwell to style, uh, to style that up for you? I can't read. I'm just after a quick word. Would you mind? Sure. I can tell it's so gonna be something annoying. But I guess I'm newly freed up for time. Thanks. I'll get straight to it. It seems all of you in Team Star are headed for expulsion if you keep up your current activities. So why, uh, why won't you break up the team and start attending class at the academy again? <laughs> That's what you want to know? As it happens, we're actually waiting on a pal. Though, we don't know if they'll come, if they'll be coming back. A pal? A close friend of yours, are they? Uh, they're only the strongest boss in all of Team Star. <laughs> like how they're a top champion who's the absolute number one trainer, trainer, you know? They're the one who invited all us other bosses to form the team. 
We call him the Big Boss. And where is this Big Boss of yours now? <laughs> Wouldn't we like to know? We haven't heard from him in, I don't know, must be a year and a half now. We thought if we kept Team Star going, then they'd get back in touch one day. But the teachers kept keep pressing us to call it quits. And then we get party crashers like you two. <sighs> Maybe the big boss did ditch us. They were talking about breaking up the team before and all. So, Team Star and this big boss of yours, they're really that important to you? <laughs> Is the sky blue? Let me put it in words you eggheads at the Academy might understand. They're my greatest treasure. Ah, I see. Fascinating. All right. Cool. All right, tear it down, everybody. <laughs> -ta 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 -ta. All right. Shadow, it's me. It seems Giacomo is no, lo no longer carries his star badge, the symbol of his status as a boss. He gave it to you, did he? Yup. I see. With its boss out of the picture, the Sagin squad is pretty much done for. Oh, Giacomo. Uh, excuse me? Sorry, got caught up in my own, in my thoughts for a second. Now, about your reward. I'll transfer some LP over to your phone as promised. Cool. Well, thank you. You earned 5,000 LP. You can now make more kinds of TMs using the TM machine. I took the liberty of adding some new entries to the range of TMs you can make at, a TM, at TM machines. These new TMs should help you improve your Pokemon's battle capabilities even further. In any case, you did some solid work out there. So much so that you deserve an extra extra reward. Someone someone from my supply unit will be there soon to give you some materials for making TMs. Cool. You have a... Oh! Hi, Penny! I think that's your name. <laughs> I, sorry, I say think because I, I guess we haven't been formally introduced, I guess. Hello. I'm Penny from the supply unit. You probably don't remember, but you got me out of a tight spot by the school stairs. I was glad to help. Oh, so you do remember. But um, I'm helping out with Operation Starfall as part of my independent study. You know, the treasure hunt. I'm good with machines and hacking and stuff, so I'll be working behind the scenes. Okay. So, here you go. Your bonus reward from Cassio uh, Cassiopeia. I, I don't know if I'm saying her name right, by the way. You should be able to make a ton of TMs with those. And Cassiopeia said you'll get more rewards each time you take out one of the one of Team Star's bases. Also, um, I heard all about how you had your Pokemon charge into battle. Seems you were pretty amazing. With a trainer as strong as you on our side, I'm sure the operation will go just fine. Uh, there's four more squad base bosses left, so um, good luck. All right, bye bye. I love your backpack, by the way. <laughs> okay. So. What is going on around here now? That's fair enough. So is there anything to do around here now? Or is this kind of a one and done spot? I kind of assume it's one and done. Oh, that is, I, I wanted the map. That's the button. Okay. All right, well, let's go this way. We should probably get to town. That was long enough that we'll probably just end the episode upon getting back to the town getting back to we haven't been there at all I'm so smart with words hello 
That barricade over there is part of a Team Star base. Team Star is trouble, so battle me instead! Did my team get healed? I hope it did. <laughs> but magic card. Okay. Uh, no, my team did not get healed. <laughs> Great. <laughs> well, this was not well thought out. Granted, he's using Magikarp. Granted, I'm also using Magikarp, but mine's dead. That could be a problem. Okay, you use Peck. I said it could be a problem because it... That. <laughs> But it's fine. I really could have died to this guy, though. I feel like I was definitely playing with fire. <laughs> well, I am, because I guess I couldn't trick you even with, a, with, with such a slick battle uh, invitation. Blah, 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 blah. I can't speak. All right, well. Let's go ahead and heal our Pokemon, and we have arrived at a new town. So, you know, I, I do probably have a slight problem going into this. Because, um, pretty sure this, uh, yeah, this gym is a, is a water gym. Um, I don't, I don't really have grass. Let's see. Because really, let's see. I think Squishy is really the only... Yeah. So Squishy is really my best bet for the gym. And it's absorbed, so it's not a very... It's not a very powerful move. Um, maybe we... <laughs> well, maybe we'll do the test... The, the gym test, obviously, and... Oh. This is an elevator. Okay. Fair enough. Did not... think that that was gonna happen, but okay. Um, but yeah. So, maybe we'll, we'll do the gym test. Which probably involves, you know, some trainers and stuff. And then uh, we'll see how things go. If the gym test is harder than expected, we will come up with some other plan. But, but for now, that's going to be it. So thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please let me know down in the comments below. And maybe leave a like. And if you want to catch the next episode as it comes out, go ahead and hit subscribe. But for now, that's it. So, see ya!